This is Mike installing the Panasonic mount. And we got it nice and solid up there. It's creased at the back. So it ain't going anywhere. And then we can fine tune it by tilting it and uh, panning it and whatnot. So we're pretty much there. Thank you, Mike. Okay, we're on day three of install for Metaverse. And I'm delighted to say we've got the Panasonic mounted securely and safely. Uh, thanks to Mike Kittermeister, uh, sculptor and mechanical genius. And uh, it has adjustable tilt and a bit of roll uh, if necessary. Um, and it's illuminating the screen very well and it's super solid. So I'm really happy to have probably the most difficult projector mounted and ready. Okay, the second projector is the Epson uh, stand, which we've just set up. And uh, I'm real happy that it's finally mounted. So you can see it up here. Um, very safe and secure and bolted to the floor. And uh, the image of that will be over on this wall here. So that achieved my goal of having a nice big uh, 16 by 9 picture. So 9 feet high, 16 feet wide. And uh, people will be able to sit back about a screen distance or so before they start seeing it. So it's a nice viewing distance for the main 3D activity. Uh, that's the Epson 3D. So in summary, um, everything's pretty much on track for day two. See you guys soon at the show. Test running starry night a little bit. Just on a small projector. Looks pretty good. Here's the first projector mount I designed uh, for the Epson 3D projector. And uh, the idea was to get it up high without having to make a ceiling mount. Worked out pretty well. Okay, I have the Epson up. It looks great being 16 feet wide by 9 feet tall. Um, I don't have the 3D set up yet, but it's nice and bright, and I think it's going to be a lovely image once I get the 3D all sorted out. So that's day three install done, going home to have some rest.